Hi right, guys, let's get into a 10 minute game. I'm currently, what is my rank currently? 1982 after yesterday's absolute catastrophe. I'm just looking over there now because I've got another monitor set up for my uh, uh, Twitch, Twitch streaming stuff. So I'm going to go like this. Yeah, I, I don't know about Twitch, guys. I'm struggling like OBS. Do you do it on OBS? Does anyone know anything about Twitch streaming? That'd be good. Um, but yeah, let's get into this game. So we've got a big center, which they're trying to chip away at. Let's try and push out this bishop. They have to take, otherwise the bishop gets trapped, I think. I know we've just dropped this pawn. What are we doing? But we've got this. But they just take, removing the checkmate threat. Why, why am I playing so quick? <laughs> I've just been playing bullet, and, uh, and now they get that. I mean, what am I doing? Yeah, bullet literally ruins your, your life, guys. It makes you so much worse at chess. Uh, don't do it. So again, maybe this, trying to set up mate threats. But yeah, we've just dropped two pawns playing too quick. So like that is a double threat. How do they stop both threats? Trying to target the loose piece in the position, guys. Also got to be aware that we've got a loose piece. But well, I'm liking this openness here. And they, they get the loose piece out of the position. Fair enough. This targets the rook. This targets the rook. And threatens mate. There we go, guys. There's the double attack we've been looking for. Absolutely stunning. And that if they move this, the, the queen's hanging, so. Yeah, it's just, just over, I think. Unless they're going to try and trap my queen. Maybe I should just get castled now. I'm up a rook, but I did drop a couple of pawns. So let's just try and clean this up nice and tidy. And I'm just trying to slow myself down. First thing I did in the morning is play bullet. Not good for your mental state. Not good for your chess. I need to write in my diary. <laughs> So, back here looks like cohesive, getting the queen back in the game. They are hitting my bishop. So if queen here to defend the bishop, and they somehow hit my queen, they've got like this, I go here, they go here, I take, take this. I think I'm fine. So if this, can they somehow pester my queen? That's the only question I really need to ask, I think. This adds another attacker to the queen and bishop, yeah. So, uh, this is a bit annoying, but I think I have to just play a solid move. This looks solid here. Bring a rook. Drop this pawn. But then at least we get castled, right? Yeah, let's just get castled. I don't mind giving up a little bit of material. My pieces are sort of scattered right now. I'm just going to give up a pawn for the position. Get queen back. They're offering a queen trade. Well, that's just silly, isn't it? That can't be good. I mean, I don't even know what they're threatening now. I just castle. Fancy that, a 1900 player. I don't think he realized he was offering a queen trade, did he? I, I don't know. A, a 1900 player should know not to trade pieces when you're losing. That's just unforgivable. <laughs> so we've got this. Here. They got this. I go here. They take, I take. We don't need to move this. I'd be happy with the trade. So I can just, like, counter. Go after their bishop. Can't come here, I cover that square. This, I'm very happy. Let's get that pre-move on the board, guys. Oh, and by the way, this is my first day um, after I quit my job. Um, well, I didn't quit, but I wasn't sacked, for those of you that are wondering. I, there was a, a, a contract, and I, didn't, I chose not to extend it. Um, I probably could have stayed on if I wanted to, but I wanted to go traveling, so... 
yeah, so I've got a bit of free time in the next few months. So if anyone wants any chess lessons, <laughs> that would be that would be good if I could get a few more. I've got I'm teaching a few lessons. Um, fills my time, gives me a bit of income, but yeah, got some time for more now. So this is hanging. I mean, I don't know what this guy's doing. We've got seven minutes. We can just really relax here. This is covered. This is covered. Why don't I just bring the final piece into play? What if they do this? Does that pile on the pressure? I can just move the bishop, though, can I? I was thinking, is, is there any pin in the position? So, we got that. Looks okay. So, here, here is covered. I'm just trying to restrict every single move they could maybe have. And this, I think this is pretty restrictive. Um, they can't go here, here, or here. Yeah, I mean, knight on the edge of the board. I'm not too scared. And now if this... This would stop it going here. So let's just go in now with the rooks, I guess. Um, double up. If I double up here and here, can this knight cause any mischief? I don't think so. Just trying to trade off the rook. Against Rice Mill. So here that would lock in the bishop a little bit. Um, I don't mind it though. The bishop's going to have an escape square, I think. They could do this though. That could be annoying. Yeah, so maybe let's lift the rook here and just open up the diagonal again for the bishop uh, just to get out of any... Oh, that's the same thing. <laughs> that There's still this fork, but then I get this move. So should we bait them into the fork and then I go here, solidifying everything? It's a high-level move, guys. They're going to do it. They're going to just snap. No, they don't. They want a rematch. Um, should we leave it there, guys? Or should we do one more? That's quite a short one. Let's do one more. See if we can get a little streak back towards 2000 after that absolute travesty of a game yesterday. That one minute video I released. Where I got smothered mated. Uh, so what is this? What do I normally do against this? I don't know. I don't... I think... Guys, let me know in the comments. What do you think the weakest part of my game is? Because... I'm starting to think that maybe it's openings now. Sort of moved around. I think it used to be end games, but I've done a bit of work on them. So, do we defend this pawn or is that greedy? This we get. We get checks. Check here. I, you know what? Let's get greedy, guys. Let's open up my king side. <laughs> Alright, and this just trades off my double pawn, but does develop one of their pieces. <laughs> Alright, now we've got to get careful. Um, just get some pieces out. Okay, so this covers this check square. And now... Yeah, what do we do? This looks nice. Bishops are uh, nice before bishops. Maybe. I don't know, guys. I'm scared. I hate, I hate it when I do this. I, I can't resist just taking the free material, but then I get myself in a little pickle, you know? This looks solid, this pawn move. So if this we take, because they're, they're going to look to smash things apart. The rook is opposite my queen. I want some reinforcement here. Uh, so let's take. If they take me, I get this. If they go here, I get this. Can I just use this as an opportunity to develop? This, this. I'm pretty far away from castling, so I really want to play like... Actually, this move looks nice. Because then there's no revealed attack on my queen. It just blocks up everything. Yeah, so cover in there, cover in here. Yeah, guys, let me know if you do want to see me on, on Twitch. 
something I've been thinking about for a while, and I'm going to have more time to do it now. So, um, so now castles defend. Although, is it a proper defense? If this and takes, if I take with a rook, they win my rook and still open up my pawns. I don't know if castles really works. Takes, they take my queen. Do I get anything there? No. King up? This? No. <laughs> oh god. Maybe I, uh, maybe I need to do that. But then takes is an attack on my queen. Castle and take on the isolated pawn situation. If this takes here, I mean, I'm just, I'm just so open. My king's getting attacked here. Doesn't look nice, does it? I don't know how to defend this piece. I can't move the bishop. Rook. I can't, I can't defend it with either of these three pieces because they're more powerful than these two. I need to defend this with a knight, but I, I can't do it. And I created some counterplay. I really don't like this position. Yeah, it doesn't do anything, does it? They take. I really don't know. Maybe I'll try and castle queenside and just take on these isolated pawns. Yeah, I think that's the best bet. Although I don't know how my queen's even going to move here. Let's see what they do. They're going to give me doubled pawns. Bishop. Oh my god, this is hopeless. This is really bad. Uh, yeah, I couldn't see a way out of it, if I'm honest. This, they get check. I... I can't block with anything, can I? This, I mean, the rook joins the party, so I have to come here. This rook in here. Well, actually, maybe it's okay. This rook here, or this check and here. I actually think just. <laughs> Going up and letting the rook come into the game is better. As weird as it looks. After this, I didn't really see what they've got. We need to trade pieces, guys, if we've got any hope here. We need to trade, like, the, if we could trade the queens, we'd be all right. Um, so this, trying to trade queens. And then if I could get queen here, that'd be like... Cohesive, I know I say that word way too much, but this. What are they doing, you know? What are they actually doing? I'm, I'm surprisingly not even that scared. I offer the queen trade. A pin. Oh, that is a good move. I don't really want to move my king again. This though, just centralizing a knight. And now this knight, this bishop is attacking their queen. Uh, wait, can they sack? Takes here. No, I don't think so. And now I want to get this moving. What is the material count? We're, are we even on material, I think? But if we do get this into an end game, I'll have the more active king. So that might just be winning if I can trade down. But I have got a nice isolated pawn. Uh, and their king's going to be pretty quick to the center. Three moves. Mine's two moves away from the center if we got everything traded. So let's see if he realizes that this is now attacked. He should do. It's 20-35. And I'd love to pop out with some sort of check. But... Oh. That would be a king-queen fork if the bishop wasn't there and this pawn was pinned. <laughs> Hopeful. But this looks nice now, hitting the bishop, starting to come out. 
We've only got four minutes. Uh, let's try it. Also that. Okay, this, if takes, takes. I can't take because this would be uh, bishop still pinned, right? Uh, did a little time, time. How can I distract this queen? This doesn't work. What about just creating an alignment issue? Bosh. Trying to move this bishop with some sort of tempo on the queen. This piece is looking semi loose. But so my whole mindset is focusing on this queen now, guys, because it's holding the loose piece together. That's why I'm banging on about this queen. So if here, here, it gives them an isolated pawn. And then. Um. It seems nice. I'm going to just do it. I don't have much time. And then we'd love to set up this threat. How can we do that? This takes... What do I get? This. This here. Check. No. I mean this. Just play it quick. Play it quick. It should be maybe okay. Maybe a little... Uh... No, because... They just take. Oh, it's not quite working. Um, looks okay though, doesn't it? Anyway, I don't know. I'm just gonna play that instinct. So I'm just trying to like bring all my pieces around the king. Try and create some issues. Try and maybe set up this threat in the future. If they if they move the bishop, we'd have this winning the queen. Um, so this, this maybe. Uh, they're also targeting this pawn here. This opening the queen up. Uh, try it. Two minutes left. Hitting their queen. My queen's now open. My rook's rook. Sorry, my rook is open. Um, what? What am I missing? I realized before when I was saying about, oh, I've got this monitor on the side, like, that's, that's like the classic um, thing that cheaters do in it. I got a bit scared when I was saying that. Um, it is good though, so I can have my OBS, so I can see myself recording on one side, and then I can go to my chess.com on this side. So we, what do we do? Uh, is, is there a check? Is there a check? Uh, let's, let's do this, let's do this. Because there's a check, and then that wins that pawn at least. Um, this is it. getting a bit low on time, but we're okay. Maybe I should have brought the rook activated it, but I saw this. Getting that. Maybe they've got this. Yeah. Adding pressure. But if, uh, check. No. This to defend, hold everything together. Oh god, this isn't, may not be that easy. This, and if we step out, of the pin, then we can now activate my bishop. We've got two minutes to do so. And I've got a pass pawn. Oh, I wasn't actually defending it, was I? They've got they've got a few pieces now. But I've got the more active king in the end game. Uh, if here they get in, I think I have to go like here. Try trade the rooks and I've got a pass pawn. Yeah. They, are they just going to repeat moves? Be annoying. I'm just not going to let them in, but they might just repeat. Okay, we're going to try and trade rooks. They should not trade. They really shouldn't trade. There we go here. Try and win this pawn. Uh, same again. I mean, same rules apply, eh? One minute left. Okay, now we push. They're going to bring their king. This, this. We're trying to win this pawn.
Or here? Well, no, because if this, they give me a check. Check, though. Cheeky. Push, but they... Uh, what do I do? What do I do? Um, go after their base? Yeah, because if takes, I get this. Deflecting the king. It cannot take. Nice. Deflect the king anyway. Okay, now go after their base. One minute left. They've got a check. But it doesn't do much. Uh, can I go like this, maybe? Uh, this. Have they got unlimited checks? I don't think so. If I can just get out of these checks, I'll be fine. Uh, here. This. This. Uh, take. Attacking the pin piece. Let's not get mated. Right, that, if they start bringing the king, maybe they could mate me. Let's go like this. I'm gonna take, we're gonna push this pawn. Alright, please trade, please trade with me. Oh my god, they're being as awkward as possible. <laughs> uh, okay, so... Uh, I don't know what to do. 40 seconds left. Um, they're really being annoying. I hate this type of player. Oh, guys, I don't have my light on. I'm sorry. This. A few settings on my light. Uh, this, trying to bring the king. They're just going to give me pointless checks now. Uh... Let's give a check. What am I doing? <laughs> I literally just gave away everything. <laughs> oh my god, that is uh, actually so bad. And am I just losing now? Um, yeah, time pressure even in 10 minutes, guys. Cracking me down. I think it should be a draw, right? And get this, this. It's a draw. Absolutely disgusting. We come in now. They just repeat. I mean, I might even be giving them the win. I, I honestly don't even care. I don't know why. You know when I'm in a drawing position, and if I give them the win, I, I really don't mind. Because now their king's closer, but I still think it's a draw. I just want to win. That's it. I, I don't really care about anything else. It's a bit of a failure of mine. <laughs> so, yeah, I mean, draw. They're, are they going to try and time me out? I mean, it's pathetic. <laughs> He declines the draw. Okay. We're up against one of them, guys. To be fair, I've got 13 seconds. Maybe he's got a chance of timing me out. Take it. I mean, now they're messing up. Are they just going to keep checking me forever now? No, we get a check. Oh, but now I've let the king in. What am I doing? Uh, this. This, and now they're just going to eventually trade the pieces. They've not got a pawn, have they? So I w it's a draw. Oh, they've got a rook, though. Yeah, they timed me out, of course. Classic. So to win that position, guys, let's do it. Let's be instructive here. Because this is an easy, easy win. It's just a faff. So this is all held together. And I was just trying to give up a pawn to win this. Right, let's actually do it. Analysis. But let's play this versus computer. Ah, I've got to, I've got to improve. This is how we do it. 
I don't know how to play versus computer. So this and this is covered. Whose move is it? It's their move. It's like this here. They were, they were just staying here. So I just I think I have to just bring my king. But then if they go after this pawn. Do I eventually win it? I think I do. Yeah. Again, time issues, guys, but two winning positions messed it up on time. Hope you enjoyed. Like and subscribe. See you next time. Cheers.